I see another one in there, but they're all coming to the head now. They don't like that capstar. Between that and the betadine, they'd really prefer to be out right about now than in. Come on, stay still so I can see. There's one right there. I just almost had them. Okay, relax, relax, relax. I know you don't like this. I know you don't. I don't blame you one bit at all. I'm a wimp. You're a lot braver than I am. I'm actually thinking I see something else on him. I guess that's fur. I will be doing a more thorough exam probably after I shut this camera off. I really need to look under this magnifying glass. Stay still now for a minute. Come on. Come on, come on. If he was really frightened, it'd be a lot harder to work on him, but he's not. Like I said, an extra hand would be helpful, though. Oh, shoot, I just had him, and I lost him. It's getting old stuff is really for the birds because my eyes used to be a whole lot better than they are now. That's right there. And we're going to get them this time because I'm not playing with this guy anymore. You probably can't see this now. I'll try, but... We're not playing with these maggots anymore. I'm done with them. Uh -uh, you need not move right now. I think this one might have... Oh, there he is, and he's a big one. He is a big BB. We got him out, and I think that's the last of them. But he is going to get the rest of that cap star pushed right in there right now under the magnifier so I can see what I'm doing. It's kind of hard to try to... Oh, there is another one in there. I thought I had the last of them, but I don't. Okay, stay still, bud. Stay still. Stay still. We're almost done. Stay still. I know. You're such a champ. Okay, 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 okay. Okie dokies. It's okay to talk to your squirrels. It won't overly tame them. There's a biggie right there. Yep, there he is. Another one. So that's about nine or ten I've pulled out of him so far. And I'm going to take one more peek, see if I can see anything else. I think that might be it. This magnifier has been just the best investment I made this year. It's hard that I can't see anymore. Actually. This is my trusty little pen light. We carry these too. And this is going to probably help me a little bit. Oh, yeah, there is another one in there. Son of a gun. And he's way in. So what we're going to do with them, I'm not going to poke around with that anymore. I am going to put another drop of Capstar in that hole. And I will make sure that maggot is done. Okay, okay, okay. And now for a really thorough examination, we're going to put him on amoxicillin. He really looks like he's got something going on right there, too. Stay still. I don't see anything, but I don't really like the way that skin looks. He looks pretty clean everywhere else. So he's had his oral dose of Capstar. He's had his uh, flushing. I do know there's one more in there, but I can assure you he will be dead. The, the maggot, not the squirrel. Between the oral dose and the flushing, he's already getting cold. This guy's a little cool. He was, and he's still on heat because he is a little. His body's a little distressed right now between being very thin and just coming in yesterday and had he not been found yesterday he'd have been dead today because it's almost sleeting out it's just lousy weather here he would not have made it 
I think he's going to be okay, and we're going to dose him with his amoxicillin today. That'll be twice a day for at least seven days. And also, the other thing I do is, we have two things we do here. We have a penis that looks the way his does, as we put Preparation H on it. And it helps to reduce the swelling. It's going to help loosen that scab so I don't have to terrorize them quite so much. If I can't get the scab to loosen up, I'll have to pull it off. But usually I can get the Preparation H to work. And because he's so swollen, and if the Preparation H, if he licks it, is not going to hurt him. And then the other thing I put on him, because I feel that he has been self-sucking on himself, because animals will do that when they're starving, because they're really just looking for mom's nipple. It's not a perverted thing with, with these animals. So it's not something to laugh about and make jokes over. We're putting some yuck on him. Right on his penis and right on his genitals. And the yuck is going to stop the... Um, stop it, tastes, it tastes like yuck! Yucky! Yes! It's very yucky. And that is going to stop him from uh, sucking on himself anymore. Besides the fact that he's eating now and he's using a syringe with a nipple, he has no reason to do that anymore because we're taking good care of him. And that's the end of our story. Say good night. We're gonna go. We're gonna go give him amoxicillin, and then we're gonna give him some uh, formula. And it's safe to give them Benny back or um, yogurt with live active cultures to uh, help with the amoxicillin because it tends to give them diarrhea and the way you're putting that good bacteria back in their gut if they do get diarrhea. Say goodnight. Say goodnight. End of the end of show.